The RRS Discovery was the last traditional wooden three-masted ship to be built in Britain. Designed for Antarctic research, she was launched in 1901, and her first mission was the British National Antarctic Expedition carrying Robert Falcon Scott and Ernest Shackleton on their first successful journey to the Antarctic, known as the Discovery Expedition. She is now the centrepiece of visitor attraction in her home, Dundee. On the 16th of March 1900, construction on the Discovery began in Dundee, Scotland, by the Dundee Shipbuilders Company. She was launched into the 5th of Tay on the 24th of March 1901. Five months after setting sail on the 6th of August 1901 from the Isle of Wight, she sighted the Antarctic coastline on the 8th of January 1902. During the first month, Scott began charting the coastline. Then, in preparation for the winter, he weighed anchor in McMurdo Sound. The ship would remain there, locked in ice, for the next two years. The expedition had expected to spend the winter there and to move on in the spring. But despite this, the expedition was able to determine that Antarctica was indeed a continent and they were able to relocate the southern magnetic pole. The ship was eventually freed on the 16th of February 1904 by the use of controlled explosives which allowed the ice to be moved away by butting and shunting, thus assisting in the breakup of the ice. RRS Discovery finally sailed for home, arriving back at Spithead on the 10th of September 1904. 28th of March 1986, Discovery left London aboard the cargo ship Happy Mariner to make her journey home to the city that built her. She arrived in the River Tay on the 3rd of April to a great welcome. Moved to a custom-built dock in 1992 Discovery is now the centrepiece of Dundee's visitor attraction, Discovery Point. She is displayed in a purpose-built dock in a configuration as near as possible to her 1924 state when she was refitted in the Vosper Yard at Portsmouth. She is listed as part of the National Historic Fleet Core Collection. Discovery Point is a fully accredited museum and has won numerous national awards as well as being a five-star rated tourist attraction. <laughs>